Medusa, the infamous monster with snakes for hair and the power to turn people to stone, is a fascinating figure in Greek mythology. Her story is one of tragedy and betrayal, of a woman cursed by the gods and forced to live a life of isolation and fear. In this detailed retelling, we will explore the many facets of Medusa's tale, from her origins as a mortal woman to her transformation into a monster and her eventual downfall at the hands of the hero Perseus. Part 1, Origins of Medusa Medusa was not always a monster. She was once a beautiful woman. Her parents were both descendants of the sea god Phorcys and his sister wife Ceto, and their bloodline was known for producing beautiful, powerful children. As Medusa grew up, she became known for her stunning beauty, her intelligence, and her skill as a warrior. She was a devout worshipper of the goddess Athena, and her talents caught the attention of the goddess herself. One day, as Medusa was walking through the temple of Athena, the god Poseidon spotted her and was immediately smitten with her beauty. He approached her and tried to seduce her, but Medusa refused him, declaring that she was a priestess of Athena and had taken a vow of celibacy. Enraged by Medusa's rejection, Poseidon forced himself upon her, raping her in the sacred temple of Athena. When Athena found out what had happened, she was furious. She felt that Medusa had defiled her temple and that she had betrayed the goddess by allowing herself to be violated by Poseidon. Part 2, The Curse of Athena Athena was so enraged by what had happened that she decided to punish Medusa. She cursed her, turning her into a hideous monster with snakes for hair and the power to turn anyone who looked at her into stone. Medusa was horrified by her transformation. She had always prided herself on her beauty and now she was a grotesque creature, feared and shunned by everyone who saw her. She was forced to flee from her home, wandering the wilderness in solitude. As time passed, Medusa became increasingly lonely and desperate. She longed for companionship and love, but she knew that she was too dangerous to be around other people. She began to resent Athena and the other gods, feeling as though she had been unfairly punished for something that was not her fault. Part 3 Perseus and the Gorgon's head one day, a young hero named Perseus came upon Medusa's lair. Perseus had been sent on a quest to slay the monster and bring back her head as a trophy. Despite his fear, Perseus managed to defeat Medusa by using a mirrored shield to avoid her gaze and then cutting off her head with his sword. As he fled with the head, Medusa's blood spilled onto the ground and gave birth to two creatures. The winged horse Pegasus and the giant Grizar, Perseus continued on his journey, using the head of Medusa to defeat his enemies and accomplish his quests. Eventually, he returned to Greece, where he presented the head to Athena as a symbol of his prowess and his loyalty to the goddess. Part 4, Medusa's Legacy Despite her tragic fate, Medusa's story has endured throughout the ages, inspiring countless works of art, literature, and film. She, has been interpreted in many different ways over the years, from a monster to be feared and reviled to a symbol of feminine power and resilience. In some versions of the myth, Medusa is portrayed as a feminist icon, a woman who was punished for her independence and her refusal to submit to male authority. In these retellings, she is seen as a victim of male violence, rather than a monstrous, villain. Other versions of the myth focus on Medusa's transformation from a beautiful woman to a terrifying monster, highlighting the tragedy of her loss of identity and her isolation from society. Regardless of how Medusa is interpreted, her story remains a powerful reminder of the dangers of unchecked rage and the consequences of actions taken in the heat of the moment. Conclusion The story of Medusa is a complex and multifaceted one with many different interpretations and meanings. It is a story of betrayal, punishment, and redemption, of a woman who was cursed by the gods and forced to live a life of isolation and fear. Despite the tragedy of her fate, Medusa has endured as a symbol of feminine power and resilience, inspiring countless works of art and literature over the centuries. Her legacy continues to resonate with people today serving as a cautionary tale of the dangers of unchecked rage and the importance of self-control and compassion.